Hi there. So in this video, we are going to see how to create histogram chart in R. So first thing, open R Studio and then create one R script. Now, the next thing we are going to do is we are going to check data set name links. So first line require data set. Then you can check how links can be used. So simply run this code and for documentation you see what it is so annual canadian links dropping from 1821 to 1934 data is listed here okay so all you have to do is simply use data and then links okay and after that we will simply use our histogram for histogram we can simply check question mark hist for its documentation and you have few parameters to add such as x which contains our data then frequency density x lab axis x limb and n class these are the arguments that we will use with hist function okay so let's use hist and then pass links to it okay now i'm gonna execute this entire in one go and on right hand side in plots tab you'll find histogram created now you can modify this by changing the arguments for this so let me just create one vector that does the work for our arguments okay so we use links then number of breaks we can use let's choose 11 then you can choose whether it's frequency plot or not so i'm going to use false then what title i want for uh, my histogram will be in main and this one's for let's say color dark magenta okay so main is for title so let's use links histogram okay and after this we use xlab which will have title number of links okay so finally that completes our histogram okay just make sure that everything is properly closed and now you can execute this entire in one go and you'll find that your histogram values are changed and also the number of breaks increased and title at main and also for x-axis is changed also you can notice that we have used color parameter to dark magenta and that reflects in our histogram as well so as you can see there are two ways to use hist function one is directly giving it the data and creating the generic histogram chart and second is changing its arguments such as breaks then for frequency chart setting false or true and then changing the way chart works also colors for your chart in my case i use dark magenta you can change to any other then also change chart title and x y axis titles okay so this was a short video on how to create histogram chart in r